Alright guys, welcome back here. We're playing some more uh, Metroid Fusion. My name is Ren the Man, if you guys didn't already know. And uh, we're just here chilling in the save room. Um, we're gonna try and get some missiles, I believe. I think this is the first thing we unlock. Um, it's gonna be some missile. See, I can't even get past that guy. Oh, but yeah guys, I was saying before, I played this game like a long ass time ago. This is like what I grew up on. Um, was playing some freaking Metroid, and I freaking loved it. It was the best thing ever. Um, Okay, let me get the CO voice. I have received news from HQ. They can support you with downloadable weapons. Or downloadable weapon data. Once you have this data, you'll be able to use missiles. This will help you against some enemies your beam can't hurt. Head to the data room for the dawn for the download. I thought it said download. The data room is right here. Is your objective clear? Yes. He was asked if your objective is clear. If you haven't like missed something. With missiles, your chance of survival climbs to about 20%. Well, thanks, boss. Um, yeah, he was asked if you if that's clear in case you happen to miss something. If you always tell him no, he was like, here, let me say it one more time. And he'll fucking repeat it, and you're just like, fuck. I did not mean to say that. Like, come on. Oh, shit, now just having some more uh, reminiscing. The computer reminds me of a gruff federation CEO I served under the name... Served under, named Adam Malkovic. He called me Lady on missions from anyone else. Or from anyone else, it would have sounded sarcastic, but Adam made it sound dignified. Out of respect and with some irony, I named the computer after him. Well, that's cool. Yeah, so she's trying to reminisce of like this old CEO she had. I don't know if she had like feelings for him or what. It was kinda like a father figure. Um Hold up, what's this? Uh, I believe this is a like recharge room. Yeah, this is a recharge room. And this is a safer. Okay. <clears throat> we should get to a navigation room up top. Yeah, here we are. Okay, fuck you, navigation room. I don't need your shit. I need this, though. I do need this. Yeah, guys, I'm gonna keep on posting some, uh... Oh. Alright, uh, sweet. Alright guys, but yeah, I'm gonna keep on posting some more Tomb Raider. Um, I'm playing some uh, Elder Scrolls Online. Oh. oh shit, the power went out. Electrical interference has knocked out the elevators. Oh fuck, on the main deck. This may be related to the X. I'll work on it as, as for you. Try to find another way to the target. It's located here. Specifically in this one room. I'm reading huge bioscience, so I hope your missiles work. To reload missiles, you can always use the recharge room or absorb a special type of X parasite. You'll see them. Try it out. Is your objective clear? Yeah, so we highlighted the words in green because uh, the parasite that actually refills your missiles are green. You guys haven't noticed the uh, yellow ones do health and the green ones do missiles. Should have I had that mouse in front of me the whole time? Son of a bitch. Alright, recharge my shit. Cool beans, cool beans, and let's do this. Want to save data? Yes, please. Yeah, I want to save. Let me save. But yeah, guys, let me know if I do happen to miss like some secret missiles or something like that. I always, I don't know. Like sometimes you catch them, sometimes you don't. Um, it's kind of an on and off thing. Like sometimes I'm really, oh god damn it, I forgot about that. Like, sometimes I'm really good about catching, like, oh, that looks suspicious, let me go shoot a missile at this or whatever. Uh, but sometimes I just miss it just because, I don't know, I'm not paying attention, I just don't see it. Yeah, I fucking see you, goobly goop. There we go. Alright. Thank you. Alright, you gotta make sure. You always gotta make sure. It always helps to make sure. There's the fucking point of this being a, like a little nook right here. I wonder why. Okay, fuck it. I don't care. Sweet! Got some more missiles. Got some more missiles! Hey, what's up, zombie dude? Oh, 
Oh, there we go. Fix the sales. I, like, I know there's a reason to bring over to this room. Alright, sweet. Sweet. Oh, there we go. Alright, let's go save real quick. And uh, we'll see what's happening. Alright, let me make sure where we're at. Uh, okay. Ah, oh, fuck. Fuck you. It's fucking bullshit. Oh god, I fucking hate these guys. God, these guys are literally the worst. It's like you have to sit there and fucking wait for them to open their eye. Ah. Uh, there we go. That was actually... actually killed that guy really fast. Uh, compared to my first time trying to play this game. Cause it was like, they'll sit there and they'll shoot the fucking like, beam shit at you. And like, you don't ever know if it's like gonna swap or not. Uh, swap or not. Alright, cool. So I got a fucking energy tank. This is really fucking loud. Is this loud for you guys? Let me know. Let me know in the comment section if this is loud for you guys. <gasps> Armadillo, man! Oh, fuck, dude, he's not fucking around. They fire, too? Fuck that noise. I'm not gonna get touched. I'm not gonna do it. Fuck, god damn it. Dude, he does not fuck around. Look at this shit. Oh, come on, come on. There we go. He's gotta be almost dead though. There we go. Okay. You see, then they turn into this. Ow, fuck. Fuck. Woo! Don't touch me. Oh, fuck, he got it! Uh, 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 uh,
Nope. Nope. <laughs> Excuse me. All right. Uh, we'll go ahead and save one more time. Kind of just for shits and giggles. Yeah, this guy's some fucking ominous ass music. That's one thing I do love about the uh, 2D Metroid game, or this game at least, is um, whenever it got serious, like where like things got like super serious, like it would put on some ominous music. Like it gave you like a sense of dread. Um, at least for a kid, it did. Yeah, there's no need to go that navigation room. Uh, is there anything in here? Oh, fuck that noise! God damn, that was a Sub-Zero room. I forgot. Oh god, I forgot. There's like, oh, is there an energy tank in there or something? I have to have the Sub Zero suit. Um, which is like the weird equivalent to like, I don't know, you know, like the virus suit, which allows you like to go in lava. Well, in Fusion, um, there was, well, I think there was lava. Um, but you had to have the virus suit in order to get to super cold areas. All right, here's the one thing that always freaked me out. Oh god, dude, look at this. Oh god, this is scary. This is some scary ass shit. Ah! <laughs> oh god. Her suit fucking came to life. That was the one thing that like scared the shit out of me. I was like, oh dude, that thing is on the space station with me. And that scared the Honestly, that and um, this other boss we're gonna fight whenever we go to the uh, water environment. Um, but yeah, guys, right now we're in Sector 1. So, nothing too spooky right now. There shouldn't be anything spooky. But, uh, yeah, as a kid, that always scared the shit out of me. Because I always thought, like, oh, fuck. That, uh, the uh, weird alternate Samus is here. She's gonna hunt my ass down. And, um, god, that always gave me, like, this sense of dread. Is it again? Man, is like a weird-ass kid. Okay. The main elevator leading to access shaft has been severely damaged. It will be totally unusable for some time. Unfortunately, some unknown agent is at work. Something very powerful. Certainly not human. I'll report when I know more. Now listen closely. The X in Sector 1 has invaded the atmospheric stabilizers. They must want to alter the environment to their needs. They are already reproducing. Clear out all five atmospheric stabilizers to stop them. Is your objective clear? Yes. Now, get moving. <sighs> Alright guys, now, now call it an episode. Yeah, I just wonder what time is your objective clear? I don't know, boss, is it? Like, fuck you. Just fucking tell him straight off one day. Anyways guys, if you enjoyed the video, please let me know in the comment section below. And, um, that's about it guys. My name is Ryan the Man, and I guess I will see you guys next time.